Hello, welcome back to, uh, I think my second episode of Draw and Talk, because I think I did it once, and I didn't keep doing because it, it was like a 30 minute video, but I mean, <sighs> kind of want to do it again, so we're back again. Anyways, so today I'm going to be drawing, uh, whatever I kind of feel like, that's why I usually do one of these things. Um... So I guess, uh, you know, grab a drink or something, your preferred snack, whatever that may be, and just chill out with me for a little bit. Alright, let's start with the black color because, you know, it's superior. Uh, this looks cool, I guess. Yeah, that's fine right there. Okay, so, uh, what to draw, what to draw, what to draw. Um, I'll just start with some warm up art. Um, when I do warm up art, it's usually uh, a character I've made before or something like that because I just know what they look like already, so it's easier for me to just kind of pump them out, you know? That whole spiel. So I'll be drawing a character named Ruff, Ruffus, I think is his name. Um, he's just a circle, pretty much, and he's really pissed off all the time. It's kind of weebish. Oh, how do I do him? He's like, it's a dog. Yeah, that looks, that looks a little better-ish. Better-ish. Better-esque. So, uh, um, something I noticed that's became kind of meme lately is Family Guy Funny Moments. My friend keeps talking about it all the time. It's like, you know, it's something. I haven't been following the whole meme train lately. Because, uh, you know, college and... Uh, that's kind of a poor excuse, actually. Because it's not like a meme. It's like something you gotta dedicate yourself to. Popular to contrary... Or contrary to... Bleh, contrary to popular belief. Uh, what I'm doing here is I'm trying to find the... Because uh, he's, he's a dog, you know. And dogs have them big old snoots. Like that. I'm trying to kind of draw it. But, I mean, it doesn't follow the right anatomy of it. Because his nose is obviously right there. This part uh, usually doesn't take me forever, but since I'm on a unfamiliar uh, setup, it kind of is taking me a while. Eh, screw it, we'll work with that. Um, I usually give him a big old hat, like a police hat, but I never looked up what an actual like police hat looks like for a reference. I just kind of guess drawing it. So I guess I'll look up a police hat. Uh, police officer hat. Just to see what I'm in for. Holy moly, yeah, that's kind of accurate. You can't really see it. And, uh, that's a good thing, I guess. I don't want you to see it. Um. Alright, let's just, uh. Try to get, like, a good uh, eye for it real fast. Alright, let's do it. I think I got it. So, I'll start off with, uh... Um... So... That's kind of lame. I was enjoying it like I've been drawing it. Screw it. I don't know why I ever did that. So what I, how I've been drawing it is it's a, uh, there we go, that's good. It's like a triangle. That's his uh, little hat part, you know, like a little uh, sun protector. So he can protect himself from the dank rays. And uh, he just kind of has this part coming out like so. 
And I've been meaning to give him something like a badge here, you know. I don't think I've ever gave him anything there. So you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna put this these giant ass uh um bone sunglasses, cause every dog likes a bone, you know. He's a he's a, he's a pretty serious pupper, but uh, he gets the he gets the job done. I'd say. I don't even know if the glasses go up on this part of the hat. I think they do. Like I don't. I just like to guess this kind of stuff. I've been giving him a scar, but I mean, it's kind of a joke because you know most people like I feel like scars are a really big anime esque thing. Especially scars in the eye. But it's kind of grown on me that he should have it. So I've just been uh, drawing him with it. My favorite part about him is his ears. Because like uh, in Undertale, all the goats, they got, uh, you know, they got these big old droopy ear things. I really like the droopy ears. Looks like a rabbit almost. <coughs> Except it's really sad and probably in the rain. Poor feller. Anyways, uh, um, I know uh, dogs, you know, some of them got them pointy ears, some of them got the droopy ears, so Rufus just happens to have really droopy ears. And it just kind of matches his uh, whole piss off personality thing. I don't know if I ever, like, do that side. I don't want it to be, like, too thin. Anyways. That's Rufus. Um, usually this is shaded in. I guess I'll do that real fast. Um, Rufus is a sidekick. A sidekick uh, partner, you know, because I feel like most police do, I guess. And it's Natalie. And she's a space unicorn. But I thought about reworking her because I don't know what else to... Because uh, the whole idea is that she's crippled. And she only has her two back legs. But, uh... I don't know, a little space unicorn thing. Like, I like the idea of it. But, like, I feel like I draw them too similar to Hasbro's styles of their ponies, you know? And I don't like, uh... If I ever went, like, uh... And sold my work, you know? I don't want them to come sue me, because... You know, that's kind of dumb. Anyways... So I thought about redesigning them, but really I uh, haven't. So I guess we can dick around with that idea in mind. One thing I've been... So I'll just draw her original one, just for comparison purposes. She's kind of doofy. Like, uh, think of her like Mabel from Gravity Falls. I've watched maybe a couple of... Not a couple, I've watched I think a season actually of Gravity Falls. But, uh, there we go. I was trying to. She has a tongue sticking out because, you know, it's silly and wacky and random. I also gave her droopy uh, ears, too, for a while. Um... Okay, how do I do this? She could be a goat. She could be a goat. Star is a goat. Cause I like your beers, you know. Screw it. Yeah, fuck the system. We're gonna do it. This is how I draw goats, anyways. Uh, looks like little devils. I guess Lucifer is kind of a devil. He's kind of a goat, though, isn't he? He's like a goat, uh... Probably some horse thing, too. I don't... I don't really know. I don't want her to have those eyebrows. I kind of want her to look doofy. Uh... Space unicorns, you know, they have... Okay, so this is the original. We're gonna do original first. I'm getting sidetracked. We're going to do original. 
Bam. That's cool looking. Let's give her the haircut. Let's give her her ears already. I gave her this kind of like a toothpastey kind of swirl thing because I thought that would be cool. I don't really know what to do with her other part here because I don't want to just kind of like do that because it looks kind of doofy even though she's already doofy. Uh, hang on, let me just fucking think about this for a second. Let me do some real brain training here. Um, she could have something like that. She already kind of does though. So I probably won't worry about it too much. Uh, I remember I did give her a necktie. Because, <laughs> excuse me, I thought that would be kind of cool. Uh, how does she even become a police officer, really? Here's her badge. Alright, let's just do the hair part. That's probably good enough for the hair. I'm not even gonna try too hard on it. Uh, you should get a little bit of blush. I also thought about giving her buck teeth. I think that's how you call it. Looks a little funny. I don't know if it kind of comes off like creepy-ish though. So I kind of been like, uh, you know, not totally trying to do that. I thought about making her a chicken for a while, so I guess we'll draw the chicken form of her. Uh, it's not, it's not much really. It's just uh, her with a beak and no horn. She looks Torchic-esque. That's extremely torchic esque. Hang on, let me think about this. What do chickens got? Uh, turkeys got that little thing. I think uh, chickens do too. I think roosters do. Forgive my knowledge of fucking chicken anatomy. Oh no, we're gonna, we're gonna leave it at that though. Because I don't know where else to go with that. Oh my god, this Facebook post. What is this about? <sighs> I thought about making her a cat. I never drew that one before, so. Ooh. Whoa. Alright. What's up with this? What's happening? What's wrong? What I do? What in the hell? I can't even draw. Why can't I draw? Why is it taking me to eyedropper tool? I don't have that selected. What? <laughs> what? Hold on. Why is there everything? Let me unplug my tablet here. Alright, let's try this out. Let's try this out. Okay, hang on. Okay. Wait, why is it... Alright, okay. I was about to conclude our episode right there because of that, but good thing I had a moment to think. Alright, so, uh, kitty cat Natalie. Let's try that out. You know, cats have, like, really big, adorable eyes.
She wouldn't look like this all the time, I don't think. Cause... Okay, this is kind of cool, actually. Um, and we'll just give her full years, I don't care. Hair, maybe? Does she need hair? She needs hair. Ruffus probably has. I drew Ruffus with uh, some rough bedhead kind of thingy. You just can't see it because his hat. You know, you know why you can't see it. I don't got a baby, you guys. Y'all are pretty smart people, I think. I hope. Um. I'll let me just load up some more music here. Y'all kind of quit on me for some reason. Alright. Oh, cat's got whiskers. Even though I probably won't draw them. Because uh, I'm, I make myself out of pixel art. Let's give her a... Let's draw her badge up here. Like I couldn't, I couldn't place my thing for some reason. Make me mad. Okay, okay, that's kind of cutish, I guess. Let's draw that again, except with more personality instead of that. I actually really like this. Uh, we need to give something to like, like kind of stand out. I mean, I don't you know. Oh, mercy, mercy, mercy. Okay. Um. I actually really like this. Let's see if we can give her hair. Let's make her blush. Alright, hang on. What the fuck was that? Oh, I'm my TV. I'm watching a... Uh, or I guess listening to A Thousand Ways to Die. Um, yeah. Cats are fucking mean. Sorry. I'm just having like cat flashbacks. Let's give her a big ass scarf. That's what I do if I always draw scarves on people. Because, you know, scarves don't mean I don't have to draw a neck. Not that I can't draw them, but I don't like to. Look at this. Look at this girl. It looks like a Harry Potter esque thing. Um, how long is this episode already? 19 minutes. Alrighty. Uh, we can keep going, I guess. I don't really have a problem with that. You know, whatever, uh. Whatever keeps me afloat. Let's draw uh, some sunglasses on Natalie. Yeah, let's do this. I like drawing sunglasses a lot. I learned to draw sunglasses from uh, 
Flip Note Studio. If you guys don't remember that. Uh, Flip Note Studio, in case you don't know it, you're living under a rock. It was uh, animation software that Nintendo, that, 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 that Nintendo made back in like probably 2008-ish, I'd say. It's pretty dated. Um, you probably can't get it anymore. Um, they brought it back, kinda, for the 3DS. You have to be a Club Nintendo member, though, which I was, so I, I have it, but I don't ever use it, because the online isn't available for it. I mean, uh, it's pretty great, but I learned how to animate from there. I'm not super good at it, that's so why I don't really do it. I also don't have the time. I could rather be doing something else with my time and animate. I also like to sit down in one sit setting, sit, sit through and get something done, but animation, in case y'all don't know, it takes, it can take up to months and weeks if you're doing like, uh, like doing like 10 seconds of animation it can take like, oh hell, that's quite a bit actually, hang on, like, so, <clears throat> yeah, here's my shitty math comes into play because uh animation uh professional animation i think is 24 frames a second i think don't hold me accountable on that but uh you know your whole second it's probably like two uh, Two-ish days of animation, maybe. If, depends on what. It depends on how you're animating. Like if you're uh, if you're doing all the shortcuts, like you got uh, like if you're doing like tweens, it can save you time instead of having to free draw every single frame in between. But that's not how I like to do it because I like uh, drawing all the extra frames and such. So you know. That looks like a girl, or I mean a boy. I want to give her a bow, but that's like, that's too generic. What's something girly that girls around their necks? A cop attire esque. She's a galactic police uh, department kitty. Um. Hmm. I'm trying to Google like uh, uh girly neck ties. <laughs> oh, I'm 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 stupid. Yeah, I know what a necktie is. You know, I kind of like the idea of necktie still. Let's do it. Ooh 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 ooh. You know what cats wear? Yeah, you know it, you know it. They wear these little things. Oh, that looks really wrong, actually. I take that back. I apologize. Uh, okay, hang on. I'm trying to draw a, uh, like a, like a bow, you know. Then we draw like like the little bell in the center. There we go. I like that. I, li I like that. It's kind of like hey or meow meow. Uh, man. Oh man. Am I drawing the background layer? Oh fuck me. Well, whatever. Um. We got some free space still. Let's uh, let's doodle that sucker up. Do 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 do. do. Um. Uh, 
Let's, let's try to draw something like a little bit more realistic, I guess. I mean, might as well. Kind of want to do, uh, let's do an Overwatch character. Because I like Overwatch. Uh, Overwatch. Might do Genji's. Or Genji. I, I was saying Genji's because I was typing it in. And I spelled it Genji's on accident. Hmm, not Lucio. I don't want Jaws hair. Bastion now. Maybe Roadhog. Um, in Overwatch, I play, uh, I guess technically my best hero is Genji, but I like to think it's Junkrat, because Junkrat's my second. I kind of play everyone, though. I don't really know what to draw. Let's just do Genji. Screw it. Might as well. Overwatch. Genji. Let's pop up a picture so it looks at least accurate. Because, you know, drawing from memory is... I mean, it's... You can do it. But it's, uh... It's something alright. Alright. I think I got the one I want to use. Let's just... So let's just go for it. Why isn't my thing working? Let's go. My tablet's doing this thing good. Hang on. My tablet's a little garbo. Alright, we'll use my mouse. Because my you know my tablet's always not gonna work for this last part, so I'll show you some cool mouse drawing skills. But drawing a mouse is impossible. Well, you kind of got that right. It's not easy. Especially with some realistic-ish. Um, what we're going to do anyways for a fun little last segment. Um, this like connects to like his upper helmet part. And it's like a thingy up here, like, like a little antenna. Um, Okay. This isn't horrible. For a mouse, John. Um, you obviously can't tell probably which parts are which, so we'll just draw this big ass cranium over here. We'll leave uh, some shines there. That is obviously his. The part above what I'm highlighting right here is obviously his little face part. Let's clean up some of this line art crap. Oh, I forgot. I'm on the. Here's the easy solution. We will just paint in white. Always use layers, kids. Do, do, do. Um, So, uh, yeah, that's, that's pretty much Genji. Kind of want to keep going. Alright, um. Oh my god, I did not draw from far away. That's, that's almost filthy. Okay, anyways, uh, I'm going to say this will conclude our... 
Oh, my pen's working now. I'm going to say this will probably conclude our draw and talk session. This is Jake. Wepsum. And, uh, have a good one wherever you are.